Hey friends, welcome to new business ideas. Today we look in the business. How to start a razor making business? Starting a raising rubber business is always profitable. You can make a profit for yourself and create jobs for people. Basically, a rubber eraser is an important item for the all students. This product is popular among kids and is in high demand. Erasing mistakes is done with the eraser. An eraser, in its most basic form, aids in the removal of pencil and, in certain cases, pen writings. Furthermore, typewriters, tailors, and bookkeepers all utilize the eraser on a daily basis. An eraser is typically included in the essential school stationery category. The process of producing an eraser is simple. Natural rubber can also be used to make a rubber eraser. Furthermore, the firm only requires a minimal initial investment. So, if you want to start a small manufacturing business, you can definitely consider starting this business. Market potential for rubber eraser. In fact, a rubber eraser already has a sizable market, and there is an increasing demand for high-quality erasers that correctly erase the lines. In addition, the endpoints of some wooden pencils are covered in rubber. As the educational sector expands, so will the demand for high-quality erasers. Apart from that, a rubber eraser is required for a variety of other activities. Rubbers are commonly used by tailors and bookkeepers, for example. Compared to other manufacturers, starting an eraser company is quite simple. You can run the machine with two to three raw materials here. In addition, the manufacturing procedure is easy. So, with the right distribution plan, you may get into a large market in your region. Space required for a razor making business. To set up this business of a razor, you will need at least 500 to 1000 square feet of space. The size of the space depends on the level at which you are starting this business. If you are starting this business from a single machine, then you will not need to take a large space. Additionally, have a regular supply of electricity and water, check the transportation facility. And also, determine the specific space for machinery, keeping raw materials, for finished goods, and for a space for admin work. Registration and license for a razor making business. Even if you start your business on a small scale, you still need to enroll your business. By enrolling your business, you get the benefit of many government schemes. In general, this type of business does not necessitate any special licensing. You should, however, check with the local government. In certain states, operating a business as such necessitates obtaining a specific license from the local municipal authorities. You should consider registering for MSME Udyog Aadhaar online. Furthermore, in order to start a manufacturing business, you must first register for GST. Investment for the eraser making business. If you do the business of a razor on a small scale, then you will need at least 4 to 8 lakh. On the other hand, to start the business of a razor on a large scale, you will need more than 10 lakh rupees. The expense of raw materials and power is determined by the size of the company. If you do not have the money to start an eraser business then, you can take loan from private or any government banks. Raw materials for eraser making. To create erasers, the most important material is rubber and there are two types of rubbers used for this purpose. One is natural rubber and the other is synthetic rubber. Synthetic rubber is made from petroleum chemicals like ethylene and styrene. Natural rubber, on the other hand, is derived from the latex of the rubber tree. And other ingredients, organic dyes for coloring the eraser. Sulfur for vulcanizing the eraser to make eraser strong. Vegetable oil also used for making eraser. Further, you will require abrasive, lithopone and factors for making eraser. In addition, you will need consumables for the packaging. Machines for eraser making business. Typically, the eraser machine comes as a set of various mechanical components. In fact, the rubber compound roll mill, hydraulic press, cutter and grinder, boiler, stamping machine, and other parts are required by the main plant and machinery. A kneading machine is also available. It also has a frequency controlling inverter. It has a heating or cooling jacket on the outside of the cylinder. At the same time, you can heat with hot oil, electricity, or steam. A decent machine will also have a stainless steel body. The machine's cost is determined by its quality and output. Manufacturing process of a razor. Before making an eraser, you have to decide whether you want to make an eraser from natural rubber or want to use synthetic rubber. 
Then, once you have decided which type of rubber you will use, you buy that type of rubber. But when you take synthetic rubber, you get it like a powder. Whereas natural rubber is not available in powder form. That's why you first have to make the natural rubber which comes in lumps like powder. First of all, you have to mix all the above mentioned chemicals in the rubber powder. After mixing these ingredients well, you have to melt these ingredients with the help of the machine. After melting this mixture will become slightly soft and solid. After which you will have to give this mixture the shape of an eraser with the help of the machine and your eraser will be ready. After making the eraser, the next most important task is to pack them. Often the eraser is packaged in two ways, in one type of packing, the eraser is covered with polythene and in the other type of packing, it is covered with paper or cardboard. Out of these two types of packing, you have to choose one type of packing for your rubber. Marketing for eraser business You can also promote your eraser on a small scale, for example, you could publish information about your eraser in the local newspaper. Aside from that, if you like, you can provide free samples of your eraser to youngsters in your city schools. So that children can learn about your company's eraser and then purchase your eraser from the market. To promote a higher level, you may need to spend a bit more. You can air your company's commercial on television networks to advertise it widely. This type of publicity is extremely expensive. As a result, you should only use this marketing strategy once your company is well established. We hope in this eraser making business video will help you in initiating your own business. If you like in this video please like and comment. And if you enjoyed this video, share it with your friends. Thanks for watching friends. For more business ideas, subscribe to new business ideas.